that's on the vehicle. You, you can take it and just twist it like that yourself and look at it. And if it has like more than 10 cracks per inch, it's, uh, it's junk. This is junk anyway. It's like there's like deep cracks. But the reason you'd want to replace this for sure is this drives the entire system now in the car. It drives the water pump, the alternator, it runs off the crank. The crank is the main horsepower producer to twist this belt, so it's driving the alternator and the water pump. So if it blows and you're on Highway 401 on a Friday night, rush hour traffic, holiday weekend, your smoke will overheat the car. And then and the reason I'm explaining that is on modern cars, okay, this is what a head gasket is, okay? And this is from a really old engine. I keep it here for this reason. This is cast iron. And this is cast iron. So the coefficient of heat expansion of those two is exactly the same. And it's a steel gasket. But on modern cars, this is aluminum. Most of the blocks are cast iron. Some are aluminum blocks now, but aluminum is very expensive to produce a block out of that. And the gasket's made from material. It's made from like a fiberglass material. So if you start overheating an aluminum head on a fiber gasket on a cast iron block, you could blow the motor too. So